This video is brought to you by Nebula. Today, I'm excited to talk about the Nebula Capsule 3. This is a 1080p HD laser projector that comes with a built-in battery and Android TV. And here's the coolest part. It fits right in the palm of your hand, something you can't say about many projectors. Today, we'll look at the Capsule 3's top features, image quality, and best use cases. And I'll ultimately share with you why this has become my new favorite portable projector. As always, I will leave the purchase links down in the description where you will also find information for a limited time special discount, but more on that later. Starting off with the unboxing, you can see I have the special edition uh, Transformers version here. Now this is limited to just 4,000 units and gives you this really cool artwork on the box of the uh, Optimus Prime character who possesses laser eyes, much like this laser projector. Uh, inside we get a good looking remote, quick start guide and the batteries included, always good to see. And then beneath that sits the star of the show, this is the Capsule 3 and check out this stunning finish. Uh, now before we take a closer look inside the box we also get a power brick and USB-C cable. Now back to the Capsule 3, the brushed aluminum design feels cold to the touch, is durable and also shows the color so well. You get this striking uh, purple red colorway with these intricate details on the fronts that I think looks really bold uh, and especially cool. Now, the first thing uh, that stood out to me with the Capsule 3 is, of course, its tiny size. It weighs in at just 900 grams uh, and takes up less than 900 milliliters uh, of cubic space. And you can see it comes in this cylindrical shape, making it not much bigger uh, than a large can of soda uh, or a small water bottle. And this means it is super ergonomic and quite literally fits in the palm of your hand, making it super easy to take it with you on the go, uh, easily slip it into a backpack, uh, even fit it in a large hoodie pocket. Now, this opens up a lot of different use cases, uh, which I'll share with you as we go throughout the video. But how is this small size possible? Well, Nebula is the first uh, to put laser technology in a form factor this small, and this allows the projector to be this tiny and still produce a sharp uh, and bright image. On the front of the Capsule 3, you will find the laser, uh, beneath which you will also find a camera, and this assists in setting the image. Uh, and it's actually really cool how this works, but I'll show you this more uh, in a sec. I do wish there was a lens cover uh, or some way to protect it whilst it's in a bag. The metal design uh, has this dot pattern which goes all the way around and this of course is great for airflow uh, as this does have a tiny fan inside uh, but don't worry this is something that you barely hear uh, even if you're close to the projector. Now what you do hear though uh, is the 8 watt Dolby audio speaker inside and I was actually quite surprised by how good this is given the size of this projector. Have a listen. As you can hear, uh, you really get surprisingly good sound out of this projector. Uh, it can easily fill a room, and especially if you're near it, even with a group of people, this on its own will already be enough. On the top, we get some backlit touch controls, uh, which are really great to use, and of course, easy to see whilst operating in the dark. Uh, and then on the bottom, we get a tripod thread, which enables even more flexibility for how you want to mount uh, or place the Capsule 3. And then on the back, we have the uh, power button and then also a mode button. And this allows you to switch between a dedicated projector mode and a dedicated Bluetooth speaker mode. So it's pretty cool to have both of these functions uh, in this single device and to be able to quickly switch between them. And beneath that, we have the I.O., which has an auxiliary input, which allows you to hook up any big external speakers uh, if you choose to. We also get a full-size HDMI 2.1 port where you can plug in a PS5, uh, your Switch, your laptop PC, uh, anything really. Uh, and then we also have a USB-C port to charge. The Capsule 3 packs a 15,000 milliamp hour battery, uh, which is large enough to allow for up to two and a half hours of video playback, uh, which is above average when compared to other projectors in its class. You also get Wi-Fi and Bluetooth 5 for streaming, uh, connecting to the smartphone app and using Android TV 11, which is built right in. And this is really important uh, as this means you get good software right out of the gate with all of your apps and streaming services installed, meaning you can get started right away. Not to mention, you also get Google Assistant and Chromecast built in too. You can see they really packed a, a lot into this tiny thing, but the question is, what is it like to use and what is the image quality actually like? Well, first, the image is sharp, and this is thanks to having that 1080p HD resolution, uh, where many other small projectors in its class are still limited to 720p, and the difference in detail that you get in the image is really significant, much sharper on the Capsule 3. 
You also get HDR10, and this means you have high contrast between the lighter uh, and the darker parts of the frame, and this is especially apparent in movies, making it much more immersive. I was also uh, really impressed by the colors. Now on many projectors, uh, they can look a little bit washed out or have sort of a green or sometimes yellowish tinge. Whereas on the uh, Capsule 3, things are really quite balanced and the colors are vibrant. The laser inside the Capsule 3 produces a brightness of 300 lumens, which is also brighter compared to others in its class, which typically use LED, uh, which are also bigger in size. And this is because laser technology is actually 1.8 times brighter than a typical LED. Now to be clear, uh, the Capsule 3 is not built to compete with bright artificial light or the sun. Uh, for that, you would need the Cosmos Laser 4K, which I've also done a review on, uh, which I'll leave linked in the description. But this does mean that the Capsule 3 is still bright enough to be able to use in environments uh, that aren't pitch black and where you still get a fantastic image. Again, being brighter than most uh, in its class in terms of price uh, and definitely in terms of the size making it ideal to use for a dimly lit evening uh, or at a party or late at night. The Capsule 3 also uses MEMC motion to keep fast moving objects sharp and detailed. And this is especially important when you're gaming. Now, when it comes to the different use cases, I use the Capsule 3 in my bedroom most, where I simply rest it on my headboard and then project onto the opposing wall. No cables, no stands, just place it and play. It doesn't get easier than that. The Capsule 3 can project an image of up to 150 inches, giving you that proper cinema experience anywhere in the home or really anywhere you place uh, this tiny can of soda. I, I mean projector. <laughs> the two and a half hour battery life is great, means you can watch a full movie without the need to charge. From time to time, I also use the Capsule 3 in my living room or in my kitchen. And here the minimum throw distance of just 0.5 meters is great. And this means that even if you are very close up to a wall, you still get a very crisp image. Another big reason uh, why the Capsule 3 is so easy to use and set up no matter you place it uh, is a built-in feature called Intelligent Environment Adaptation, where the Capsule 3 will automatically detect when it is moved and then automatically correct the image uh, in terms of the keystone, which is the angle, it will set the focus, uh, even avoid objects, and then adjust the size of the image accordingly. And here you can see it in action. Watch when I move the projector, it automatically corrects the image in a matter of seconds. I love this. There is no need to mess around with settings. Uh, just place the projector and give it a few seconds to figure everything out on its own. And this gives you lots of flexibility for where you choose to place the Capsule 3, ensuring you always get a good image. Also great uh, about laser technology is that it actually lasts longer. Now, a typical LED projector, uh, the bulb would have to be replaced every 4,000 or so hours, uh, where the laser inside the Capsule 3 will last well beyond 20,000 hours. And this means you get a much lower running cost over time. Uh, it means that the Capsule 3 will actually be more affordable over time compared to its LED counterparts, uh, all while still giving a better image and also more portable size. And lastly, laser technology is also more energy efficient than LED. So this allows for a greater battery life and also less power consumption when plugged in, making it better for the environment too. So as you can see, uh, the Capsule 3 really packs a punch. You get that portable size, making it easy to take with you and use anywhere thanks to the built-in battery. It is also truly effortless to set up as it does the angle and focus, all that automatically. You get Android TV, Chromecast, and Google Assistant built in, meaning you have everything you need to start streaming right away. And when you do, you will really enjoy the image that is up to 300 lumens bright, where colors are vibrant, and of course, that sharp 1080p resolution. Whether it be in the bedroom, uh, living room, or even outdoors, the Capsule 3 just kind of fits in wherever you place it. And this opens up more use cases, uh, allowing you to bring a projector where previously you couldn't. It never hurts to be the one in a group with a good projector. And all of this is why for me, the Capsule 3 has become my new favorite portable projector and is a big part of my home setup and is something I plan to travel with in the future. If you're looking for a portable projector, uh, the Capsule 3 really is the benchmark and is hard to beat, providing an excellent all around package. I will leave all the purchase links in the description where there is also a limited time discount for April, which will give you $120 off your order, making it an even better deal. Now the black version is also available, but I would definitely recommend you go for this limited edition transformer version that I have here. Let me know if you have any questions at all, guys. If you haven't seen them yet, I highly recommend watching my review of the larger uh, Nebula Cosmos Laser 4K projector, which I'll leave linked on screen right now. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.